assalamu alaikum in our previous two videos we have created uh, the edmx file which maps the database and also we created a manager which manages the uh, database but there is no call initiator in our project there are many ways we can call the manager class like uh, from the unit testing method or the web API or even creating a single Windows form application uh, to create the call on the console application uh, f for now I will create a simple console application to understand whether the, the, the data is already creating sorry adding or not as we have tested in our last video there is no data currently in our table see so let's create a console application right click add new project console application and we'll name it student management dot console application what will you do here is to call the manager class and that manager class will call the IDMX or the database and do the database related things for now we will create or insert a new student so I will add student class in this project reference student new this is the sorry object initializer suppose we'll create student his address is uh, maybe in Africa or even in Bangladesh and it has a phone number which is one two three four five six now we will pa we'll pass the student to the manager so we'll create student manager add the reference manager student manager and manager dot add our student and we will s show data saved and we will wait for someone to enter or write something it should work there's not a problem the problem is when we build this application let's build it this console application will create a bin or what you can understand is the exe let's see it okay here it is see the exe but the problem is there is no configuration file by which the manager and the model can execute the function I mean the database function so where to insert where to update there is no information here so we need to add a application configuration file here inside of that app config file the connection strings and the others will be located so what I'll what will I do is control C or right click I pressed control C already and here we'll delete it oh it has a config so let's copy copy everything and 
paste it here rebuild it rebuild the solution let's check it its properties see it is not paste it to the output directory so let's do it again generally I use that keyboard shortcut but since you are watching to help you I using the mouse ok so let's see the pin again well you can see the app config now the next problem you might uh, see uh, you might occur is that if you press the start it will say the uh, output library sorry let's say let's show it to you it is the problem why it is the problem because you can see the school management model is more darker or bold than the manager and the console application why is this why is that it is because it is created as the startup project now a single class library project cannot be run so we will run the console application like this right click set as startup project and see the darkness is come to the console application now and let's run it again and it will save a student automatically or should we have a exception excellent what it is saying is okay it's good to have exception it makes our learning better it's because we haven't added any entity framework here so let's add the entity framework you can also install the entity framework from the web I generally do in my office uh, I generally uh, install from the web but if you don't see it uh, or if you have if you don't have the entity framework in your machine you might need because since the time is passing I'm installing it from the web let's pause it ok I'll do it in another way it's also another option see what I did I'm doing it again console I'm pressing since okay let me de let me describe it to you since I have already installed entity framework in my model project so there is no need to install it again in this project rather we can manage the packages for the solution so installed already entity framework press manage and I am referencing the console application and the manager for simplicity Referencing, referencing it everywhere ok for testing it is already test everywhere yes to all save it again
rebuild it again and run it again what exception do we have now oh fantastic that I saved now let's see whether the data is actually saved or not show table data let's refresh it well this is the data we have inserted just now last thing I will end it after this part let's fetch the data uh, so how will we fetch the data student manager manager new student manager well we don't have the get function so let's create the get function uh, maybe we'll do it in the next next video thanks for watching Allah Hafiz